Hey, Kenny. How does a new actor become a household name in Hollywood? Home porn movies seem to work. Yeah, like it works so well for Screech. Or you can land a killer role in a hit movie. Or you can suck my balls and get a huge role. What if sucking your balls is not an option? Sucking my balls is always an option. Um, I mean, I grew up in L.A., so it's a little bit different for me because I know some of the bullshit and I know the people that play the game and like, hey, baby, like, I'll make you a movie star. Should like, I guys, not be believing those no, things? Don't believe it. When they say, like, those are delicious <laughs> boobies, which they are very delicious boobies. <laughs> Why, thank you. <laughs> don't, don't, don't believe them if they say they're going to make you, you know, but you know that. You're too smart for that. I'm new. I'm hot. And I'm ready to play. You can't take me with you, but you can hold me for a little while. No, no, don't do it! No, it's too sexy! What's up, you guys? I'm Carrie, and I am here with a very special guest from the movie Saw 3, Bahar Sunak. What's up? Hi! How are you? I'm great. Happy to be here. Oh, my God. You're in Saw 3. It's outstandingly amazing. And you know what I love? You've seen it, and I have yet <laughs> to see my film. Hello, America. Do you want to play a game? So you got the script and you went, oh my god, yeah, I totally want to be in this movie. Well, it's, here, here's the thing. I, I'm a total dork. I am so freaked out by horror films. I was so fucking scared. I would see Saw 1 and 2 posters. I would avoid it because it totally creeped me out. And then I got the call that I got offered the part to play the lead in this film. <laughs> And they sent me the script, and I was up until two or three in the morning hysterically crying because I was so freaking scared. I had nightmares. I would, I'd be in my sleep going, oh, ah, ah. Totally freaked out. I, you know, I fought like hell to get that movie. Fuck you, bitch. This is my film. Bring on the blood. Oh my god, fuck, I have to do this film. I was happy that I had to do the film because it was so cool. So being afraid of things like this, when you had to shoot things like this, how do you, I mean, are you like freaking out at the sight of fake blood? People ask you, they go, well, when you're on set, it's not that scary because you know it's fake, right? As an actor, but it's totally different because as an actor, you really have to believe it's true. You have to, in your mind, it's it's all real. Those those devices, the the traps, they're real. Tobin is not Tobin Bell, but he's Jigsaw. So it's a really dark and scary place to go. So and you're on set all day, and the set itself is really scary. It really, really is. And um, you start at you know sometimes you're on set at 5:30 in the morning, and you're done shooting at 11 or 12. It's still on your mind, and you go to bed, and you're just dreaming it. You know. Well, I've met Tobin, and I have to say that he is, it, it, voice alone is probably one of the scariest people. I can't even get it out because he freaks me out. <laughs> he, he has that aura about him, doesn't he? He does, and he just has that look. When yeah. he looks you in the eye, it's like... It's so funny you say that. <laughs> because first day we arrived, they're like, you know, Tobin, Bahar, you guys are going to go out to dinner with the director. And I was so creeped, I, even, I mean, it's, it's a movie. And I know it's a movie, but Tobin's sitting across from me and he's, we went to a steakhouse and he's eating this steak, this bloody steak, and I'm watching him and I was terrified. Like, it was so gross. It helped fuel my, my fear and it helped fuel me for the film. Help! Bring on the blood. Oh yes, there will be blood. Watch his legend grow. Saw 3. Rated R. Bonjour. I get paid by the pound. By the pound. Get it? Aha! Uh -huh. Get it? I get paid by the pound. Saw 3. What a fucking hell of a roller coaster ride. Check it out. Who's your daddy? It's no good!
No good television. We'll choke your chicken. It's no good.